Hey guys, Django here. Uh, welcome to the sixth part of our uh, series on the premium uh, planes released in Weapons of Victory 1.70. Today we're looking at uh, Plagueis' Spitfire LF Mark 9. It is an exact copy of the normal Spitfire LF Mark 9. Mark, Mark 9 yeah. Um, same speed, same turn time, same rate of climb. So we are basically looking whether it's worth it to spend the money on this to get an extra one of these in your 5.3 arcade battle lineup for the British. Let's have a look. Hey guys, so here we are in the match. It's a domination map. Uh, it's not my favorite map, not even close. But we will have to do it with this map and see what we can do. We are full weapon at the moment, trying to climb. Now, this plane is an awesome climber, though we should. We should be able to climb above most people. Let's wait for the web to refresh. And there we are. And seems to be going alright. Two B seventeens, Tempest there, an I one eight five. He seems to be going right there, that's good. B-17s. Let's try to get this one. The other one is already on fire. Now uh, we got him. Let's try to stay up. Reload for a sec. Alright. I don't see any climbing fighters at the moment. But there is a B-17 coming. Try to get it to at the B seventeen. There he is. Stalling out. Try to climb up at me. Got his wing off, that's nice. Now, I saw two B-25, we have to be a little bit more careful of those, and a Spitfire there is trying to climb as well. And that is not good. Another B-17. That Spitfire needs to be pushed down, or killed. Either or. B-25 there. Spitfire. Maybe the Spitfire first. Don't like a Spitfire at this altitude. Like to get him out of the fight if possible. He's on fire. Uh, but he's not on fire anymore. He's just smoking. We are extending. There's a BF 109 up high as well. He may assist me. Uh, 
Alright, let's see if we can get him down. We got a hit in. Yes, he's down. Alright. Reloading. Checking. There's a D14 coming there. We do not want him to shoot at us right now. Let him try to come. Let him stall out. And we'll... We just reloaded. He should be stalling out about just right about now. Yes. He's on fire. I think he will die. Hopefully. <coughs> that fire looks rather active. Yes, yes, he's dead. Okay, so we're staying up. Cooling the engine for a little bit. Now let us go back into the circle. Into the point. P47 coming up there. We got a full web here. Yes, he wants me. He's not getting us. Turning off. We will loop into the vertical. Come at him from up high. Uh, he's diving for it. I'm not gonna leave my altitude here. That's just not worth it. BF-109 did decide to follow him. Which is fair enough. A B-25 is coming. I'm going for that uh, Spitfire over there. Be careful though. dead. Okay, up. Left off. B-47. Right over there. B-25 on my tail as well. That uh, P-47 is on fire. He's dead. Uh, I didn't want to shoot at the P-47. I think uh, the BF-109 uh, got him. And that is uh, fair enough. We'll leave it to him. See, where is our buddy anyway? I think, did he get shot down? I think he did. We got to cool our engine for a little bit. Yak 3P coming up. There's several other fighters trying to gain the altitude. Ah oh no, our friend is still here. That is good. Laps are raised. Okay, let's see what we will do. There's several guys here now. P51 is gonna be. He's dead. Spitfire. Up at up. Come on. Where's that B25? There he is. B51 there. Ah, 
there he is. V25 shooting at me. Now the P51 got pushed down. So that's alright. We're going to stay up here for a little bit, turn around, cool the engine a little bit more. And there's four guys trying to come up here. And we don't want them here. We've got a P400 up here now as well. That is good. And where's our friend? There's our friend, the uh, BF109G. Tempest here. See if we can get a shot. That one seems to be climbing. Dead. We're going up. Reload. We are capturing the zone apparently at the moment. We are overheating again. P51. Plus a Spitfire coming up. Let's go for the Spitfire. Other dudes on fire. Two years, or what is that? Bow fighter. We got him. Uh, let's see. Let's see. What is that? Tempest. You gotta be careful of the tempest. We're whipping again to get up. Let's do a loop. I've got a f <laughs> I've got a minute a minute of fuel left. That's funny. Okay, let's get the firefly. We got an assist on that. Wow, that was close. Roll! Wow, that was close. Where is he? There he is. Laps on. Alright, let's see if we can get him. No, no, no. That's the end of the match, guys. Alright. Well, let's see how we did. <coughs> Nine and zero. Not too bad was a nice match. Bit of a slow beginning but uh, enjoyable. Alright, uh, I'll see you in the conclusion guys. Hey guys, so here we are in the sixth part of our premium review series on the premiums released in Weapons of Victory patch 1.70. We have just flown Plagueis' Spitfire LF Mark 9. We did a couple of matches, not only the, the ones uh, I showed to you. And it did very well. So like I said, this plane is an exact copy of uh, the other uh, Spitfire that's already in the game. With a different skin, of course. Um, it's a very good plane, guys. You, you So you can use it as a boom and zoomer. You can use it for energy fighting, you can use it for turn fighting, it is... It can fulfill all those roles. It has a good roll rate. Climbing is excellent. Turn time is excellent. It's got good firepower, uh, maybe even excellent firepower, because the 7.7mm machine guns have been improved since the last patch. So this thing can shred other planes to pieces. Two uh, Hispanos are good, of course, and now the Brownings are nice as well so 
this plane is nothing to uh, talk down about. It's it's a, it's an excellent plane. Do you want to spend money to get it in, in your lineup? Let's say that if you have a uh, enough places, because there are they have added the uh, sea uh, line, uh, sea fires. Uh, there's one sea fire, and I just unlocked this one as well at 5.3. And there's plenty of planes uh, the British have to fill a lineup at 5.3. So it is not really like this plane is necessary in a lineup. But if you enjoy this particular Spitfire and you do well in it and you're like, oh, well, I would like another one of those because this plane is capable of getting to altitude in the middle of a match with no problem. So you can continue what you were doing before uh, if in the case you get shot down. This is definitely a worthy buy. Uh, this plane is just an excellent plane all around. It's it, and it, on the side of that, it's a good looker as well. So yeah, I could recommend buying this plane to you uh, if you have a little bit of free money. It is definitely worth the buy and uh, it will definitely perform for you. It's a good plane. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed that. If you did, uh, feel free to uh, like the video, or leave me a comment, and uh, if you want to see more, subscribe. I want to thank you all for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.